hint with the other Hansen 16. What are the differences? 63, 83, 63, 82, 62, 85, 63. Wait, the 13.7 is better than the 370 now. Interesting. 82, 61. I want the Hansen 16 inch. 82, 82, 62, 82, 61. This thing has 29 recoil. I guess you could technically get um even lower. Or in a better ergo with the with the rail panel. So with a 60 round mag, this thing's gonna be fucking zooming, no? Huh? There's a new gas block. Oh low wait, low pro. 64. Wait, this is 6429. 6427? No way. Wait, so this shit is 27 recoil with 64 erg? But that's without the 60 in it. So it's got 46 erg with the 60 rounder. So it's still, if I don't, look, if I just shoot, I won't even move my mouse. It, this is what it looks like. So it still does have, it still does recoil a bunch. What if I put an RK2 on it? I don't think there's anything I could do to get lower recoil, right? 55, I've not. 39, 55, 53, 50. So this gives you one less recoil than the 20 inch barrel. This, this might f*** it up, the, the, um, RK2. 25, 25 recoil, bro. It kills, it kills the Ergo, though. What if I did, a uh, the Gangsta Boy? That's definitely better than the Express Grip. The Erg is still really snappy. What else could I do to it? 26 recoil with 40 Erg and a 60 rounder. That's kind of nuts, no? The Mur upper. So the, the the other upper, this this one, it gives you one less percent recoil reduction, but it gives you 14 ergo. The mur is like minus four and like plus three. It gives you so much more ergo with this. So technically putting this stock instead of the, the MOE, what's the ergo difference? Three ergo. And then this gives you eight. So that's five. And then that gives you seven. So your trade-off in Ergo, you make up for it with the other stock, and you get a little bit more. I mean, like, you could get even more Ergo, but you don't need it. Like, you could put these guys on it. Where's the other one? These ones give you Ergo 42, and then you could put Irons, too, if you really wanted to. So now it's got 44. I mean, this shit seems nuts, no? That's, this thing seems fucking crazy. I'm gonna save the build, edit preset. Save as M4, oops, not my M4, suppressor. I'm gonna save that shit, baby. That thing seems crazy. Are we in M4 meta this wipe then? With these new parts? They like, they snuck in a bunch of new M4 parts. And then I could I could box like Zuckerberg or something. It'll be great. Prime fucks you over. How does Prime? Wait, what? How does Prime fuck you over? Bose, thanks for the three months. Well, 
Like Amazon Prime? Or are you talking Twitch? Twitch? <laughs> how, how does that... I don't know. I'm not quite catching your drift here. Stop paying for Prime. I don't know. Amazon Prime is... I definitely get my money's worth out of it. Like the the amount of times I've needed something for like to stream like a cable or something and I just fucking same day Amazon delivery for a cable that I needed like that was that shit was so worth Oh, is that the kababi? That might be the kababi. I think shit, even the other day, you know how many different like audio mixers I bought and had like one day or same day delivery for the stream and then I returned the ones that didn't work to Amazon? Like, bro, that shit alone was worth my Prime subscription for the year. Like, just that. <sighs> Lesh, thanks for the two months. Okay, so this has got to be Kaban, bro. Let's see how this M4 rolls on him. I'm gonna let this out. There's another guy over here, I think. I'm gonna let him either die or um, fight Kaban a little bit. Pizza. Could I would do it? Uh. Hey, yo, you think I could just sneak in and kill Kebab? Seems like the mach the machine gunners. Yo, this gun slaps, bro. This thing's a beam. All right, I think we just got kebab left. I need to hit him with the reload strat. Yeah, bro, this thing is insane.
Come on, Lexo's key. Let's go. Yes. Yes. What do I gotta go to extract? I don't care about any of their gear, guys. I'm just getting out with that key. That key is worth shmoney money. We have crash site house. Okay. They don't really even have great gear on them. Every time I've looted them, like, I really only end up picking up some helmets. Lexo's key is like two point something mil probably right now. Plus the machine gun has got... BS ammo! Oh, bro. I just got like 300 rounds of BS, bro. What is BS ammo vendor for? That shit is, that's like a mill right there, bro. Oh, it's, only, it's 1400. I mean, it's still a couple hundred K, but it's actually less than if this was, um, if it was PS ammo, I could have, I could have fleed it for more. Maybe I'll just keep it then. I'll probably just keep it because 1400 around, bro. That's like what you pay for. Like that's cheaper than BT ammo for like the SVT. I could just run BS ammo in the SVT and clap everything. Yeah, I'm just gonna save it. Vertebra pork kebab is roasted meat that originates from the Middle East but has been popularized by Iranian cuisine and Turkish cuisine. Many variants of the category are popular around the world, including the skewered shish kebab and the donna kebab with bread. It's also a dude that works at a car dealership on streets of Tarkov that has a big old machine gun that just got absolutely slaughtered by a laser beam M4. W raid chat. W, W, W. W. Thanks, Murder. Thanks, Hyper. Thanks, Mimalu. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. Come on! So, yeah, this M4 is a complete laser beam. This thing is nuts. I was only shooting 5.6A1 too. You see how fast I killed Kaban with that, though? I just, like, I peeked him and he just fucking dropped dead. Bro, BS ammo on this thing. Also, my, my PKM shrine. Oh, bro, look at that. There's <laughs> so much BS ammo. Oh, we're gonna have fun with that in SVT, man. Let me list the key though. What is the key going for right about now? That's a daddy. That is daddy landmark. <laughs>